Hi, my name is Hans Schumann. I'm an executive career and life coach. Today I want to talk to you about two distinctions that may be useful for you if you're at the point in your career where you wonder, should I stay or should I go? And you might find them particularly interesting if you are in the situation where you actually experience your job as quite safe, quite cozy, quite comfortable, and you wonder, why should I leave something that isn't actually broken? Well, if that's you, keep watching, because the fact that you're still pondering about a career change or job change means that there's probably more behind this. The first distinction I want to offer you is the one between your job being safe and you just perceiving your job as familiar. Safe versus familiar. What do I mean? Well, sometimes when we think our job is safe, it's not really safe. It just feels safe because it is familiar. It's familiar because we know the people, the company, the policies, the firm politics, and we know exactly what is required from us, and we even know the unpleasant side. We know the stresses, the demands, the unpleasant people we have to deal with from time to time. All of this is familiar. But it doesn't mean that it's safe. There are a few jobs nowadays in corporations where you have real job security. In the last job where I worked in financial services, there were redundancies every year. Nobody really was safe, even people who were outperforming each and every year. Other people can get ill if um, the stress takes its toll, or they, their relationships suffer, or they miss out on fun in their life, on fulfillment. None of this is really safe, is it? So if you perceive your job as safe, have a think about whether it really is safe or whether it just is familiar. The second distinction I want to offer is similar but looks at the issue from a slightly different angle. It is the distinction between feeling comfortable in your job and just feeling comfortable in the discomfort of your job. Let me talk this through. Maybe you are indeed one of those lucky people who are in a comfortable, cozy job. Nice salary, nice people, good working hours, and it's easy for you to do what is expected from you at work. If that's you, great. On a side note, I would just ask you, is that enough for you? You may have heard the expression that growth only happens outside the comfort zone. So if you are the kind of person who actually thrives on learning and growing and developing, it may be time to step out of this cozy job and start something new. But that's not what I want to talk about here. I want to look at the question whether what you perceive of comfortable is really comfortable. Because sometimes when you look deeper there's a lot of discomfort. It may be the boredom because it is very comfortable, it is too familiar. Or it may be that it's actually quite stressful, that there are unpleasant people, um, that you are overwhelmed but you still it, it, um, you perceive it as comfortable because you at least know the devil. If that's the case, have a think about what you want to do with the situation. Of course, you can, you can stay in that situation. You can do it for years, for decades, until the end of your life. But again, my question to you is, is that really enough for you? Some people, like me, need a big push to get out of their comfortable job because I was comfortable in discomfort and it took me two year long health crisis to really wake up um, and understand what I want to do with my life and then create this new coaching business. You don't have to wait until something like this happens. You always have the choice to explore what it is you really want from your career and from life generally, and then create a new job or a new career that feels more inspiring, more fulfilling and challenging in a positive way. I hope this has been useful. Do leave a comment if you like. I would love to hear your views. And thank you for watching this video. Bye.